Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 um, 365 Day Challenge. What am I doing? I'm looking for this. <laughs> looking to put it full screen. <laughs> ah. um, so, um, I'm really sorry. I'm going to say this again. But I'm really sorry that I haven't posted videos in a little while. Um, things at home are a little bit hectic because we're like moving and such. Um, so hopefully things will settle down soon so that I can just relax um, and record for you guys and such. But until then, I'm going to do my best to try and catch back up. I know I'm quite a bit behind. Um, I want to try and post two or three a day um, to catch back up. And then once I catch back up, it'll be like one or whatever, you know. But the thing is, is unfortunately, um, I just recorded this and my microphone literally was unplugged like very, very slightly. And so it had no voice. So I'm re-recording this for you guys. I was planning on doing two recordings tonight, um, but I might only be able to get one now unfortunately but whatever um it's fine and um we got a lot done in this so i'm gonna try and do some of the stuff that we did before obviously i can't promise everything is gonna go the same i don't know um i didn't mean to rock i meant to nap i'm sorry um but yeah so Leslie finished pottying and the xylophone in the last one, which she's just about done with the xylophone. Um, and everybody else kind of did their thing. Now, he does still need to do his homework. I know that because he got up last time and started doing it. And I was like, why do you not have your homework done? But yeah, a lot of people don't work today, so we'll be working with them. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fast forward because they're all pretty much sleeping except for Leslie. So it's not going to speed up. But it will, um, but it will, um, I'll be back when, you know, someone's getting up for the day. So I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so she just finished the, the, the xylophone, the xylophone, and Logan is actually up. He's going outside. He's going to do his homework real quick, and then we're going to get him to take care of his needs. I always forget that Logan is a genie, and he can just magically clean himself. And also, I'm also going to have him summon up some food. And I'm going to have him summon up a, a whole plate thing of, um, let's see, where is it? I'm trying to find what we had last time for breakfast. It wasn't mushroom omelets, but that'll work. So go ahead and do that. And we'll get that going. Now he does want to sell a baked good, so we might have him do that if he gets a bit of free time. Um, let's put this in here. All right, so come in here and grab a plate, and then I will let you use the bathroom, okay? And when you're done in the bathroom, grab a plate. When you're done in the bathroom, grab a plate. I have you grab a plate, and Janelle. And Mandy, you didn't need to shower, girl. You don't know what you're doing. All right, you're fine. What are you doing? No, you're not. He just summoned this for you guys. So you can put away the leftovers now, clean this up. You can clean up all the dishes and then you can eat some food because you wanna be a jerk and do it your own way. And I want you to do it my way. All right, so come up here and sleep. You're good. I'm also going to have you, Quinn, no, Mandy, I want you to potty train Leslie and then grab a plate. This will be fine. Okay, so there's a lot going on. I wanted her to play with this because of the fact that it's a doll that I want to come to life. But her mom is coming to get her, so never mind. All right, you're still sleeping. Okay. Fred, go ahead and get in bed. All right, he's going to play with it. I don't think it counts if he plays with it, though, unfortunately. 
just because he didn't play with it as a toddler I don't think it'll come to life now unfortunately so we kind of lost out on that I did want it to come to life I wanted to add them to the family but can only do what I can do you know all right so there we go she is officially potty trained and now Mandy when you're done put Leslie in the crib please and then I will let you grab a serving of this. All right, and you, you don't work today, right? No. Okay, so when you're done with everything you've got to do, I want you to play with magic like all day. I want you to work. Today is a very big day for working on lifetime wishes and trying to get a little bit farther along in them. and. Mainly just the people that are like nearing the end of their life pretty much. So I want to get them them really, really well ahead. Um, so like Emilio, he doesn't work today. So when he's done with all this, he's actually going to um, mix up elixirs. And we're going to take stuff from Mandy and throw it in Emilio's um, inventory. Because I want him to use the stuff to make um, some friendship elixirs and such that he's going to need. So that's what Emilio is going to be working on today. He's going to be mixing elixirs. And as many as we can get him to mix is the better. Better off we are. Um, now Chadwick... When Emilio is in this bathroom, I'm going to let him go ahead and use it. But before he does that, I'm going to have him discover a potion. Janelle, you're going to take some deep breaths when you're done eating. And then I want you to come out front and I want you to collect all this stuff that's out here. So just go ahead and collect that. I think she has a paper that she needs to recycle in her inventory. So go ahead and recycle that. Logan's carpool is coming soon. Mandy has to work today, so she'll be going there. Um, but she can actually go now. So you could go and just work hard. Benjamin works today. I'm going to let him just go ahead and drink the pollen punch. And then I think, because we can, we're just going to have him head on over to work and start maintaining everything, um, you know, ahead of time. So go ahead and you can maintain this, whoops, when you're done drinking. And then you can maintain this. Okay, it looks like that's okay. So I'll let you go ahead and use the bathroom when you're done. And then maybe at that time this will be ready to go, I don't know. Quinn needs to meet four new sims today. Um, and we are going to actually have him do this. And instead of him going ahead and doing like his needs at home, he's going to jump over here to the cafe. He can take care of his shower and everything right there. There's a shower in there, so he doesn't have to worry about it. Um, jar of friendships is what I want you to make, please. And Fred, when you get up, buddy... I'm going to let you go ahead and have a quick meal of some plasma orange juice <clears throat> and then I'll just let you use this bathroom. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright, so take a shower. He met you have a sleeping one. Is that what he wanted? I think it is. Alright, now I want you to use this, right? Is that what? What are you doing? Alright use it and then I want you to unclog it and then I want you to shower okay you need to go to school I really hope you're going baby is asleep so I'm not worried about her at the moment um has everyone eaten I can't remember but I'm just gonna tell him to put this away when he's done actually I'm going to tell him to get the clean laundry and do the laundry when he's done. Because that will be more important. How many of ten do you have? 
Um, one. So you're gonna need to mix more. Just keep mixing the friendship ones. Just mix a bunch of these. Okay. And you, you need to eat at a restaurant. I should have had you do that, but I didn't. You want to rake a leaf pile. Why don't you go ahead and dispose of all the dead plants and then go ahead and rake a leaf pile. That way we get that done. Okay, I want you to go out here with Quinn. Please. I want you to come on over here. I think he did go ahead and take care of his needs. There we go. See? Perfect. Oh, he forgot to go to the bathroom. So we'll get him to do that when he's done. And then I just want him to give this man a friendly introduction. And Janelle, I want you to come over here and give this man a friendly introduction. And then I want you to give him the cursed bite. That'll be her first of five, because she hasn't worked on this at all. So we need to get really working on it. Um, and that'll get her working on it. So jar of friendship, keep mixing. How many does he have, Emilio? has three okay so he needs seven more so it's one two three four five six seven that should be plenty um he's working on his magic he didn't eat anything so i guess he's planning on starving today um i'm gonna put them in the fridge because they're gonna go bad and when he's done he's gonna have to eat some goopy carbonara and then just play with magic some more all right that gets him good he does need two pieces of momentonium, so I do need to do that as well. Um, oh my god, please tell me you went to school. Okay, that must have been the male blade, the male child or whatever. Because I did hear a child and I thought, oh my god, he's still home. But no. And he's cleaned up all of these um, plants. So now what I want to do, I want to see how much we still have here. Um... It looks like we only have this orange tree, right? We have this apple tree here. Oops. Is that there? We have a Maui bean plant, um, a red toadstool plant, and then this one um, white cap mushroom plant. I think that's the only things we have planted now. So our garden is much smaller, but that's good because we're actually going to be leaving here. Um, so I do want to talk to you guys about the fact that we are actually going to be moving to the new home, um, before it's completely furnished. Did ask you guys about this and what you guys felt about it. And you guys actually said that you thought it would be a good idea to do it before because then we can use the gifts that you guys send instead of having to wait and wait and wait. So I think it's a great idea. Um, that's why I'm going to go ahead and do that because I think that... It's just going to be better if if we move in sooner rather than later and we can kind of expand when we're living there. And that way we're not always trying to work for money, work for money. We'll be working for other things too. So that's something that I'm kind of really hoping you all of you guys are kind of in on because I really want that to work. Um, and did you curse bite him? Because I don't think you did. Of course you didn't. Where is he? There he is. All right, did you give him a friendly introduction? You did, okay, now, special werewolf, okay. Werewolf, cursed bite, please. And Quinn, did you meet this man? I really hope you did, okay. I'm actually gonna send Quinn on over here. I want him to go over here to the lounge. It doesn't open until two. I was open until five. Okay, this is open. So go to the midnight moo, and we'll get we'll come over with you in just a second. I want her to do this. There we go. Okay, so this is one of five, and then this should show one of five here in just a second. There we go. Show one of five. Yes, it does. Okay, perfect. Now, we're getting there. I know that he's old, and I know it doesn't really make sense to turn old people because we're supposed to be hunting with our pack, right? But what I'm thinking is, if she eventually meets someone, turns them into a werewolf, has a baby with them, even if they're an old man, um, she would be able to 
have her child hunt with her as well. And so that would work, I think. If I'm wrong, please correct me before it's too late because that's my plan is just to have her pretty much work with her child and, you know, do everything she can that way. If that's not going to work for me, I need to know before it's too late because I will be really upset with myself if things don't go that way. So I'm going to have you come on in here. I don't think you can introduce yourself to this mixologist. So that's unfortunate. Um, is there an upstairs this place? There isn't. Okay, and I don't think she can turn a mixologist either. So this might be a pointless place to go because she can't really do anything and he can't really do anything there. Um, it's only noon. Where else could we maybe go to get some people? I don't really know. Um... I want to go to these places. Well, this opens at 10 a.m., but when I went here in the last episode, there was no, like, mixologists or anything in here, so it's kind of why I didn't come over here. But now there's someone here, so why don't you come over here and give this man a f charming introduction, and I'm going to have you come on over here as well. Now, I am working with Corey as well today and Emilio, so I do need to keep an eye on them. But he's doing okay. I'm actually going to let him go ahead and just eat. Because I think he's starving to death. So we shouldn't let him do that. And then Emilio is still cooking up those 10 elixirs. Which is also working on his um, alchemy for his work. So that's kind of why I'm having him do it. And then we are going to send one off to a friend. Which I did do in the last one. It did get sent. But I just couldn't save the episode or the game. Because unfortunately that just didn't happen that way. Um, okay, you have a bunch you're still set up to do. You're on your way over, and you're on your way over. So this works good. All right, I want you to go ahead and friendly introduce yourself to this man. Now, I don't know if you can turn Taurus, because, um, I don't know if they're able to be a werewolf <clears throat> while they're over there. But I'm going to try. Okay. No, Quinn, come on, man. He's taking his sweet time, of course. Mm -hmm. Okay. And now, can you turn this person or no? No. I don't think so. Yes, you can. All right. I think that's Chadwick who got the mail. I'm going to go ahead and sell this. Ooh, he did not like that. Okay. Well, we're going to try again in just a second. Quinn, I want you to go ahead and introduce yourself. Oh, who's this? Another another person who's not suspecting us to um, turn them. Who is this? Chris Manuel. He always has, like, notifications. And this is just an, the Taurus that we tried already. But we're going to try on Chris as well. So go ahead and first bite him. Okay. Mandy got her promotion. There we go, that's number two. And then this guy is gonna be number three. And you're gonna go ahead and give this guy a friendly introduction. Why can't she turn him? You're gonna try again. Ask him about his career. And then curse bite him again. Okay, did you do a friendly introduction? And I heard someone else. I don't know where they are. Um, nope. I don't know. It's 2 o'clock though, so this place should be open. So I'm going to have you come on over here, and you should be able to do your friendly introduction with this person. And then we can go from there. So she's got 2 of 5. No. Nope. Two of five isn't bad. We're getting there. We're getting somewhere. 
Look at Emilio. He's a toad. So that means we need... We can use him to change him back, which is going to be perfect. Okay, keep making these, buddy. I hate that I got excited that he's a frog or a toad, I mean. But it's going to be perfect. It really is. Because this is going to give him the ability to change him back, which is going to be a free one for his, his thing. Because he needs a cure, like... 10 different transformed sims using the sunlight charm with a potent cure. I don't, I, I mean, I want him to do it with the sunlight charm. I really do. But I'm really scared we're not going to have enough time. So, I don't know. How much time does he have? 20 more days. Okay, before we have him do this, because it's going to be his last person he has to introduce himself to. Um, we're actually doing better this episode, so that's kind of sad, but <laughs> sorry. Um, go ahead and let's have you play a lot with magic. For some reason, when you click on witches, there's always that weird pause. It's not just me who has this issue. It's like everyone who plays with witches. Um, there's like a weird delay. I don't know why, but there really is. Okay, and how many have you created? Six. So you need to mix more. So that'll be seven, eight, nine, ten, and one more for good measure. And then just use this. You're playing in the leaves now. Okay, well, maybe that wasn't exactly what I was thinking you were going to do, but sure. Um, and then why don't you use and shower. And what is that? I have no idea. Um... We're having you taken care of. Why don't you take care of the baby real quick? Go ahead and um, change her outfit to her every day. Not that it matters. We can't ever see her outfit anyways. Um, go ahead and snuggle her. Where is that? Snuggle. Oh, my gosh. Um, feed her on the floor. And then we're going to have you teach her to walk. All right. And Benjamin... You're on the clock. Go to work. Oh, you're at a fire. Put out the large house fire. Crazy. Is it the same house? It's always this house. I don't get it. I don't get it. Why is it always this house? What's going on with this house? Um, show the tracker. We need to convince one sim to, ru to run. And do we see them? I don't see anyone. Do you guys? <laughs> Probably not. Okay. Extinguish this. See, this is the thing. With him in an active career, it does make this a little bit harder for me to work on everybody else. Because I have to be here all the time to take care of this. Alright. Oh, I do see their, har their arms now. So that's good. Did he introduce himself? He met four Sims. What happened? Alright. Um... You've been working your way up in the ranks. You publish those things you need to show your face around the town. Meet at least four new sims in order to win yourself some recognition. We did. Come over here and... Maybe those people don't work. Maybe the tourist doesn't work. Because technically they're not from here, I guess. Oh, so maybe they don't work. I don't know. All right, come on, buddy. I don't know who the sim is in there, but we'll have to get in there and rescue them quick. <laughs> All right, and then go ahead and break down the door. Can you do it? Maybe you don't need to. Um, okay, I do hear a lot of fire still, so I'm thinking maybe one of the windows is still on fire. I don't know. I don't think so. I think it's just inside now, and the problem is it's doing that weird glitch where I can't get into the home. Like, see, it doesn't say I need to, um, like, it doesn't say I need to do anything, so what I have to do is I actually have to open it up with like a cheat to be able to get in here which is sad I shouldn't have to do this but I'm going to have you come in here and convince him to run 
And then we're gonna have you extinguish the flames. Oh my gosh, look at them all. All right. Please run before you catch on fire, because you're about to. Oh my gosh, she can't get out? Why? Oh my gosh, what is that? A rug or something that's burned up? There's a puppy dog in here. Well, I've convinced him to run, so that's all that matters. He'll finish this on his own. I don't need to stick with him for that. It's really loud in my ears. Um, all right, so he's working on this, and he is working on that. Um, what's Chadwick up to? I'm just curious what everyone's doing. You actually need to just eat, so why don't you go ahead and eat some of the goopy carbonara? This man is having a really bad day with this. I feel bad for him. Um, make another jar of friendship, please. Um, okay, I need to go with you because I need to turn some more sims. How many do we have? Just two of five, unfortunately. You guys are just sitting here drinking. Of course you are. Okay, there's a man upstairs, or at least there was. Oh, here he is. I want you to come up here and um, give him a friendly introduction. And then I want you to try and turn him if you can. And you... Why don't you... Yeah, they can go on a field trip. Why don't you go ahead and friendly introduce yourself to this lady and see if that counts. Because maybe if it ha if a, it's a tourist, it doesn't it doesn't count it for the challenge. Or for that... What you call it? Alright, so he got an A. So he did good. Um, for that opportunity so that's why i'm thinking maybe if he introduces himself to someone who's not a tourist then we should be good to go um let's see she's not in her werewolf form werewolf transform don't think you're getting away yet <clears throat> all right and now Special, oh my gosh, werewolf, um, curse bite. Please work. Okay, it worked. Perfect. Whew. One last person to work on. Okay, and why don't you go ahead and get some food, get some salad. Now, did that work? Now that worked. So it can't be a tourist, if you guys are wondering. Don't do a tourist, because it's not going to work for you. Yes, you can tear up the dance floor. And I'm going to let you go ahead and order a single serving of... Just do the cheese plate. Be a little bit different than her, but pay the same price. <laughs> so she should have three. Yes, she has three. He's on his way home. And... Okay. Really, I just wanted to get a couple of these people working on what they needed to work on. And it does seem like it has... We've worked on quite a bit today and gotten quite a bit done. Now, he does want to use a jar of friendship, so we are going to do that. I'm going to have him... Um, let's go ahead and throw this elixir at Benjamin. Okay. And you are still playing with magic, which is what I need you to do. Quinn, did you get your food? Oh, he still needs to order it. Okay, now she can't turn the pianist because I tried in the last one. Um, it doesn't work. So I'm going to look really quickly at... Couldn't do anything there, but... Or was it? No, it wasn't here. All right, we're going to go to the Revolution Dance Club with just her... Um, when he's done eating, he'll do whatever he wants to do or go home or whatever. I want her to try and get two more today if I can. Um, get, finish this off before the end of this episode. And then the only thing she'll have left to do is just hunt for the 40,000 simoleons worth of items. Which, if she gets Tiberium... Actually, I don't know if it counts if it's when it's cut. I think it has to just be like the normal item. So bugs might be the best option as you can find like the spotted beetles and things and those are like worth like over a thousand normally. So maybe that'll be better. I don't know. 
I'm not really seeing anything in here. I do like this club, though. This is really nice. Um, but yeah, I'm not seeing anything. She only has eight more days, though, before she becomes an adult. So that's kind of why I'm pushing her a little bit as well. Want to make sure she's getting everything done. Um, now, he only has 20-some days. 20, 20 exactly. So he only has 20 days, and then he's an elder. So that's why I'm pushing him, because I want to get this done for him. And we obviously need to help Emilio now. Um, Emilio, on the other hand, just needs to work on his um, private readings, which we can do. That's not going to be hard. Um, and then he just needs to do his career, which is handiness. So that's fine, too. But for her, 40000 is going to take quite a bit of time. So I do want her to start as soon as she can, kind of. Um, that's why I was trying to turn quite a few of these people, but it doesn't seem to be that easy when there isn't a lot of people in your world. Um, this can be a really difficult one to complete. So what we're going to do, I'm going to actually send him home. I don't know where he is, but I'm going to send him home. Um, what I'm going to have her do is I want her to go maybe one more place tonight, see if she can at least get her fourth one, and then we can go from there. So... Let's go ahead and have her go to, hmm, let's go to, let's go to the bar and grill. I'm working with just Janelle at the moment. Need to get this done for her. I really, really do. Okay, and then I'm hoping people are taking care of the baby. It doesn't look like it, so it looks like Mandy didn't listen to me, which kind of makes me mad because she does have a few more days, only a few more days left, and then she needs to be, like, ready to go. All right, so we are here, I do believe. And let's see, is there anyone here? Okay, there's a metal right here. So why don't you collect that? That'll be good. Um, well, that's a mixologist, so we can't turn him. And is there anyone else here? Anyone at all? What's this? Wide awake? Oh, from the juice. Gotcha. Okay, so there's a proprietor here. Any of the proprietors you can turn, by the way, if you guys are wondering. Um, you can turn them, so don't think don't think that you can't just because they're a proprietor. They're free game. Pretty much who I'm targeting. <laughs> as sad as that is. Okay, and I hear someone coming in. Paparazzi. We can't can't target them either. Unfortunately, I wish we could. Okay, so we're giving her an introduction, and then we are going to go ahead and turn her. Alright, so this is number four. Once we get that little pop-up up here, it is number four. So there you go, number four is done. Now this lady, even knowing... She's like literally right here and we can do werewolf things to her. We just can't turn her. So unfortunately. Okay. I'm going to have you go home because it is almost 11 at night and everyone at home, I'm sure is not in the greatest of moods. So let's go ahead and get you to eat some goopy carbonara when you're done and get you to go to sleep. Benjamin. All right, let's get you to the bathroom. And then... All right, so Quinn's in that bed. So that means you still got to sleep outside, buddy. I'm sorry. I know it sucks. I'm not trying to be like that. I'm not trying to make it where he has to do these horrible things. But fortunately, it happens that way. All right, and then Chadwick. Um, let's get you over here, buddy. Let's get you to bed. I don't want to sleep in Logan. I'm trying to... Oh my gosh. I'm trying to sleep in my own bed. Alright. And then Janelle. 
you can go ahead and go to bed. It's getting late. Mandy, you get to nap. Benjamin's good. Quinn is fine. Fred is at work. Why don't you go ahead and work hard? And little man, did you do your homework? I really hope you did. Okay. And I'm going to have you go to bed. Because you are tired. Wherever you are. You want to play tag with Mandy? We could do that. And then the baby. Who actually needs to go to the bathroom. So Mandy. Nope. Quinn. Get on up. And... Um... Hold the baby quick. Alright guys, but I'm going to go ahead and end it here. So if you guys enjoyed this, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. In the description is all my social media links, so definitely check those out. And don't get, forget to follow me on all of those. Also, don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you are enjoying this. And share my channel stuff with everyone. Um, and like I said, if you guys enjoyed it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys in my very next one. Thanks very much for watching.